everyone welcome back to my youtube channel the lord show african fashion on styles i also want to use this medium to wish you guys had there merry christmas and a prosperous new year in advance today i'll be doing a tutorial on a pinafore short dress that's the tutorial i'll be doing for today and i will be using these two years of fabric the cutting and stitching that's what i'll be doing for today please if you are new to this channel don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so let's get straight to business so on this tutorial i will be using two yards of fabric and the length for this uh, pinafore is 38 and i will be using 40. that's what i have here already i already cut out the length of the pinafore dress so the first thing you do is to mark at the half length which i use 16 so the next thing you'll be doing is to get the front shape and for the front shape i will be using nine i will be using nine plus same allowance which is ten then ten you divide by two you have five then you mark so for you to get the ham hole that's the curve shape of the pinafore that's what i'll be doing i'll be using 14 you mark 14 mark a straight line also you use your curve ruler it's a very simple tutorial from this 14 you use your curve ruler just take it up and connect up the first thing you get your waistline for the curve shape to get the ham hook curve shape to make to bring the pinafore shape out you use 14 you can use 13 you can even use 12 but on this tutorial i will be using 14 so what you do just use your curve ruler and connect up gradually remember we use five to take the chest line you can you connect up you connect up and cut out let's see what you have here so on the back panel i will be reducing it with one inch you reduce the back panel with one or two inch depends on what you want you reduce it with one inch or two inch that's for the back panel then you cut out again this is the back panel and this is the front the front panel so what i will be doing next is to cut out the the buckle rope so for the buckle rope i will be using 20 by 5. remember you have two that will lap to the front 20 by 5. you cut out two peaks this is the buckle rope that will lap from back to front iron smoothly iron smoothly so and then turn out so that's so that and then it has a front pocket 
and for the front pocket I will be using 9 by 7 9 by 7 the length and the depth nine and then cut out remember some people want it to wide big depends on what you want so this is for the front chest pocket just turn in iron smoothly and then stitch to the chest this is the front the chest pocket this is the, the buckle rope the front pocket and on this uh, front this is the back So the first thing I'll be doing is to use the black bias to run the edge. That's what I'll be doing. To run the edge and turn inside. So let's get over to the machine. Just work on them and keep aside this is for the buckle remember it will lap from the back to the front so I'm working on the front uh, buckle now Is how you fix the front buckle on this front buckle measurement you use 4 by 5 that's what I use 4 by 5 on this front buckle measurement you use 4 by 5 you fix it in fold together and then stitch This is the front buckle. You can see the way I fist it. So the next thing I'll be doing is to use this black bias to run the edge so that it will have a smooth edge. So I'm through with the front panel of the pinafore. You can see the way it comes out. Just use the black bias, you know, to do the turning. You can see how smooth it is. So what I will be doing next is to work on the back. This is the back panel. To work on the back panel. to lap to the front so so what I'll be doing next is to fix the chest pocket this is the chest pocket
So the next thing you do is to pick the front pocket or the chest pocket, take the chest line measurement, and then pin to the front panel, go over to the machine and then stitch. And after that, you pick the back panel and the front panel together using your hip measurement to get the right measurement. And then go over to the machine and then stitch again. Make sure you iron smoothly and turn out to see the beauty. So you can see the way it comes out. Simple short pinafore tutorial with a front pocket. So beautiful. Please, if you find this video helpful, please like, share, and subscribe to my YouTube channel for more tutorials. So I will see you on my next tutorial. Please stay safe. Bye-bye.